Pike fishing is a passion for me. I love constantly searching new areas, new challenges, and enjoying the experience of being in the great outdoors. Here I am fishing with a Bombarda float and a fly in shallow waters. I'm fishing fairly slow, and I'm kind of reeling in at a regular pace to kind of get the fly to stop and move, and that gets the materials pulsating real live. Pike fishing can be so varied. Here we are trolling on a big lake with pike fisherman Christian Miller. So with the side planers here, we're fishing sort of a broad area and we got different lures working at different depths. Yeah. And, exactly. um, and also we're fishing over different depths. And these, uh, these eels uh, that we've had uh, a, a good success with today, about how deep do they fish when you're fishing behind a planer like this? Uh, right now where we fish them uh, 20, 30 meters behind the boards, they fish between 4 and 5 meters down. Christian explains how to troll with a dead herring and a plastic lip skull and shows us just how effective this can be. Oh, it's heavy. Underwater cameras show us pike secrets below the surface. We are up and close even when the pike strikes. Ah, nice fish. Fishing trips are full of excitement and surprises, and sometimes even a little more drama than you hope for. Ah, not good. Oh, 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 oh. On the next fishing trip, I'm back on the lake, joined by Frederic Julien from France, an expert on fishing with swim baits. We had a fantastic day with lots of fish, and Frederick took time to explain tips and tricks for fishing effectively with swim baits. When, when you learn them, you can, you can improve the swimming a little bit by sm some small action for, with the rods, but mainly the swim bait will swim alone. And if I reel it really slowly, it will make a wake on, yep. on the surface and that will annoy the fish and it will trigger the bite like yep. this. Good one. Yep, yep, I see it, I see it. Ah. Oh, that's a good looking fish. In Rügen, Germany, we fished with one of the most experienced guides, Robert Balkoff, and he tells us about fishing with soft baits. You can keep it high in the water, you can keep it uh, deep down at the bottom, you can uh, jig them very aggressive. Keep the tension in the line. And he also shows us how to catch one of the big brackish pikes Rugen is known for. That's what I call a pike. <laughs> 